put it to the one in the center, and now it starts. Yeah, so the low power situation. Yeah. I need that excess power and greatness. <laughs>
cell configuration so that it's operable for a 12 volt system. Hand, but inside of it is like this little bitty tiny cap in there. Uh, so what would this be in comparison? Like if that's a one farad, like what would... That's 3,000. Just this one? 3,000 farads. So, so when you put six of them together, so you're dividing that by to get the capacitance number. So you would, six together would be 500 farads. Okay. So this by itself is 3,000 farads. On a specific job, uh, when we switch back over to 3,000 farads, uh, we'll be going to 224 then. I mean, right this second. How many are you doing? Uh, right this second. Um, probably as much as that roll will allow, which is probably maybe 30 parts. Okay. Probably so going for 30 minutes or more? Uh, yeah, probably maybe 15 okay. until that runs out. I do have more material to need. You're comfortable with open now. Okay, so this is a thin capacitor production machine. What it does is it makes a, an ultra capacitor the same way that the spiral wound ones we just saw being made. The only difference is they're flat, so they fit in different applications. So each one of these ultra capacitor cells, when it's completed, will go into a much larger module, typically to power medical equipment, MRI machines, and uh, like factory backup. So this machine takes it from a raw coated cell and completes it into a, a pack. And it take it from stacking the raw cells right here and alternate them, positive, negative, positive, negative, and then it'll have a completed one come out the other end. And guys if y'all enjoyed all the hot content that you saw in that video be sure to follow me on youtube facebook tiktok instagram under the life of price and also down for sound shop on facebook and instagram and don't forget snapchat i'm jpd4s on there so be sure to check me out there we'll see you in the next one later